How is he murdered? He's quite clearly alive. He's gotta go fast. He went too fast. He is alive and he isn't alive, okay? So what does that what mean? Is it a mo cat. There you go. <laughs> He's in a box. You don't know if it's alive or dead. He's in the box. Don't open it if you don't want to know the answers. Oh, uh, that, that. oh, uh, <laughs> oh god. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> what does he sound like? Um, Phew. Made it on the train 15 minutes ahead of schedule. So far, so good for my first day on the job. Oh, I totally forgot my name tag isn't ready. I should I should make one. I'll just sign my name right here. Vapen! Did I spell that right? It's your own name. What, what? <laughs> Hope passengers can read my scribble. Dining car. <laughs> <laughs> Uh oh, am I nervous? This is the first day on the job, Jitters? Working the train's dining car can't be so bad. Come on, Vapor, shake it off. No. Ow. <laughs> Ribbon, did you, uh, just see you hitting yourself? <laughs> Mr. Conductor, sir, how are you doing this morning? <laughs> Quite alright myself. I'm feeling a bit, little bit sweet. Oh. Aww. My god. <laughs> because you're a sweetie. <laughs> Are you trying to suck up or not suck up? <laughs> trying to butter me up on the first day, are we? And uh, today's my last day as conductor. I'm retiring after 32 wonderful years. Oh, that hurts. Time oh. for me and the Mirage Express to say goodbye to one another. Well, congratulations on retirement, sir. Thank you. My wife is very excited about it. She's already got off plane tickets to Spangonia? What? Our shower's been on the fritz. I'm so excited to use the hotels. <laughs> I can see why his wife's excited. Enough of my quibbles. Today's your first day working on the dining car. Here's the menu for today. I can open the inventory any time to view items I've received. I should look over the menu carefully. The Mirage Express dining menu. It features chili dog, instant ramen, and chicken cordon bleu. Fancy. Why do you look so nervous? All we have on the train is a microwave. <laughs> Though I'm sure a little quiz is in order. Whichever these do you we serve in the dining car? A spicy grilled piggy. Ding, ding, ding. Glad you can read the menu, okay? <laughs> a little about the vessel. This is a state-of-the-art high-speed smart train with all the latest gadgets. This train can really handle anything you throw at it. We've had a lot of adventures together, me and this train. It's not easy to leave. After 32 years, I don't blame him for being wistful. This train is exclusively used for events. It's not a passenger train. I remember that from the interview. What's the event today? A murder mystery party. Nothing better than some thrills to end my ten years, conductor. Guests will be funneled here to the dining car as a home base, so to speak. I'll be with you together to gather tickets, but after that, you'll be on your own. So I don't need you to do everything in your power to make sure our paying guests are well taken care of. Understood? I'll make you proud, sir. <laughs> Glad this old man can eat rest easy. Doors to the Mirage Express are opening. All aboard! Beep beep. That looks so fancy. Ah, no. no. uh, people. No. Oh, boy. <laughs> what does tails sound like? Oh my god. A uh, 12 year old boy. <laughs> So, yeah, great. Wow, this train is incredible. What fascinating tech. You're right, Tails. I can get used to staying on a train like this. What did you all expect? You know, I always go all out for my birthday party. This train's as elegant as you are, Amy. Can't promise I won't take anything, though. Oh, man, they're rude. Did I? <laughs> you go faster. <laughs> It was a pen, Knucklehead. Who's gonna miss a teeny tiny pen? What cast of characters am I stuck with? Get a hold of yourself, Amy. You're sweating through that uniform. Hey, Belle, can I get one of those chili dogs? Radio, friend. All right, are you friendly? Why can't I be normal for one second? Sonic, wait until I announce everyone's roles to get food. <laughs> Sorry about that, birthday girl. I'll be coming around to collect everyone's tickets. Please have them. Whoever you'd like to talk with, and we'll collect their ticket. Oh, uh, okay, got it. I was like, where'd Shadow come from? <laughs> yeah, the Southern Knuckles. Uh, no Knuckles. Yeah, Knuckles out of the way. Howdy, can I please get your ticket? <laughs> <laughs> it's crumple. I think that's a ticket, but I really don't want to argue with this guy. Everything looks good, thank you. Seems the conductor doesn't want to argue either. Can I get your ticket, youngin? Right here, sir. Thank you. May I offer you any of the snacks we have on board? No, thank you. 
When I travel, I always pack my own sparkle gelatin. It's a sparkly jelly that can melt in any jaded heart. No way, I brought my own sparkle gelatin with me too. It's my first day and I was a little nervous. Don't be nervous. You're doing great so far. We're sparkle gelatin buddies. <laughs> Absolutely. If you need anything, just let us know. My goodness, someone on this train is normal. I did. <laughs> Wait a second, is he, is, is he Sonic the Hedgehog? I promise you an excellent stay on our train, Sonic. Have fun now. Y yes, have yeah. fun now. Who do thanks? Hello, my friend. Can I get you a ticket? Uh, yeah, sure you can. Of course. As a gentleman of outstanding morals, I'd love to show you my ticket. He seems to be avoiding eye contact. Place my ticket. I don't know where it is. He's not hiding his embarrassment very well. Don't you worry. We'll take a look around for you and see if it turns up. Oh, that would be amazing. Thanks a mil. Seems as though we should keep our eyes peeled for his ticket. Could you please get the birthday girl's ticket? <laughs> Why, certainly. Thank you, miss. And thank you for choosing our far train for your birthday festivities. Well, the birthday discount would certainly help. Doesn't love a good bargain. And a murder mystery train just sounds so exciting. It's right up my alley. Who doesn't love a good thrill? You see, I'm a girl who loves a good true crime podcast. Maybe we should leave her to have fun. <laughs> Before we move along for you, miss. Oh, how fun. Thank you. Where do I use this? That unlocks any door in the train. Happy birthday. The birthday girl gets the birthday key. It's practically tradition. Very useful. We'll use this wisely. Thank you. Well, hello, uh, you two. What can I do for you? My, my, how forward. Let me fetch it for you. Come back if you need anything else, you hear? Wow, she's so polite. Very easy to talk to as well. Ma'am, I saw you sneak that $20 bill out of my pocket. Gonna have to kindly ask you to give that back. Oh, this was yours? Must have slipped out. Here you go. I may not actually be the best at judging character. Fuck. <laughs> Princess such as myself must always be punctual. P -p -p princess, did she just say princess, 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 princess? Don't mind me asking, are you visiting from somewhere? A separate dimension, actually. A separate what? Just here for Amy's birthday, then I'll hop back to my own dimension. I quite prefer the birthday cake from this world more than my own, so I admit I'm a bit excited. Oh, you don't say. Well, I hope you enjoy your stay, princess. Should I bow? Do I bow before a princess? What are you doing? Please get up. Why can I not win with this group? Of course. Excellent, thank you. And I hope you enjoy your stay with us. Absolutely. I appreciate it. There's a calmness about him. Something about his presence puts me at ease. You consider me calming? He's looking right at me. I study ninjutsu. I believe one can communicate through the subconscious. Well, but ninjutsu? That sounds like a lot of difficult training. Can you cling to walls? Cling onto walls? What kind of question is that? I most certainly can. Conductor looks a little bit too smug at that answer. He reminds me of James from Jesse and James. Because he was just holding a flower. And the man in the back. Thank you. Everything is in order. He seems concerned about something. Is there anything we can help you with? Do you sell the gift bags here? Oh, no, sadly. But I have a plastic grocery bag in the back I could get for you. That stair. It's so cold. Vivian, you're shivering. Do you need me to fetch you in your jacket? No, no, I'm, I'm good. Someone forgot a birthday present. No. What's sticking out of the napkin holder? Ticket. Hey. Say, wasn't someone looking for their ticket earlier? Let's be sure to return it to its rightful owner. And let's make sure no one uses the ticket as a napkin. Just gotta go back to Alligator Boy. Find anything yet? Well, we might. We just might have what you need. Maybe why don't you show our friend here what you picked up? Ah, oh, there it is. That's my ticket. Thanks so much to you both. I was really worried you'd kick me out and I'd miss the murder mystery. Ho oh, oh, ho oh, ho, old vape in here would have hit their hands full kicking you out. You're right. I wouldn't leave without a fight. Who <laughs> 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 made me who made me both microwave expert and security guard? You're both alright in my book. Thanks again for the assist. Of course, just let us know if you need anything else. 
Okay, everyone. Time for me to read out everyone's rules for the murder mystery. And that's my cue to leave. I must prepare the driver's compartment for departure. Ah, the conductor's car. You remember our promise here. You'll do everything in your power to make sure our guests have a safe and enjoyable time on the Mirage Express. Absolutely, you can count on me. To be honest, this group seems plenty capable on their own. And train, this is Vapen if they need any help on you. The train is a... The thing? The train did it. The train did it. That's all I need to hear. You have my trust. Nothing more heartwarming than a conductor in his train. Excellent. I'll be off. I must take my leave. Everyone, please have a phenomenal time. And don't worry about fucking up the place either. This train is state of the art. It has systems to, for dealing with all of that. For everything else, please talk to me. Mm -hmm. Here if you need anything. Sounds good. Goodbye now. I like that guy. Thank you all for following the outfit guide I sent you. You all look amazing. I trust you all read your lore cards as well. Lore cards? That must be the details of their motivations. I suppose it makes sense lore cards aren't read out loud, otherwise people would know the murderer's intentions. Now, on to the nitty gritty. For the murder mystery game, one of you will be murdered and the rest, suspect. Everyone has assigned roles for characters they will be playing. Participation is required for it is my birthday. Of course. Birthday girl makes the rules. Sonic. You are a ship captain, and you'll be stationed in the conductor car. Naturally, that's where the captain will go. Tails, you are the detective for Doomed. You'll be here in the dining car. <laughs> Indubitably. Knuckles, you're the sheriff around these parts. We'll find you in the saloon. Got it. Rogue, you're a business tycoon, and Blaze, you're a titan of industry, both in the casino. What's the difference? There is none. Hmm, sounds fun. Vector, you're the butcher, and Espio, you're the poet, both found in the library. Hear that, Espio? We get to hang out together. And do what, Reed? Maybe we can make a tower of books or something. Shadow is the locksmith hanging out in the lounge. And last but not least, me, the journalist reporter. I'll be moseying around with everyone. Did you get all that? Yes. I was listening and hope that's okay. More than all right, you can help ensure everyone's following their roles. Oh, that reminds me. Oh, boy. I have a map for each of you. Everyone's station is marked on the map as well. How convenient. The rules of the game are as follows. There is a murderer amongst you all. No way. The murderer can kill a single participant however they choose, but you must physically be present with the victim for it to count. Everyone else must collect evidence throughout the train and use it to interrogate fellow passengers to figure out who done it. The murderer will lie to get out of being accused, so inspect everything you can, find clues, and interrogate. I'll set a timer for one hour so everyone can mingle and the murderer can do their thing. Is everyone ready? Sounds like everyone's excited. Everyone to your station. 